Good morning, everybody. Hey, I just wanted to do a little quick live before I head off to my J-O-B um, to show you how to make um, the cute little envelopes for your samples and stuff out of the catalog pages. So it's really easy peasy, so this should only take about five minutes. So um, hope you enjoy this and use it. It's really awesome. All right, so you take your old catalog. This is from last year. I just grabbed one. I have a whole stack. Um, and you just take out one, you can just tear it out, tear out one page, like so. And then you put it on the table the long way and you fold it about two thirds up so that it's about envelope size. And sometimes I use my other one to measure. Yeah, about two, about two thirds of the way up so that it's like that, so there you go. And then the top part, you fold the corners down on the top, like that one, and then that one, so that it's starting to look like an envelope like that. And then I usually fold the top down a little bit, or you can fold it all the way if you want to. I can't remember what I did on that one. I just folded that one a little. So you fold it down like that. So now you can see it's starting to look more like an envelope. And then you just fold where the creases are like so. So yay, now it does look like an envelope. And then to get it to stay, because these are still open, um, I usually just use a little scotch tape and tape down your little flap right there. And then I tape the sides so that they're closed. Just like this. It looks like I need a little longer piece of tape. You know, it's early, so I <laughs> didn't measure anything. So just tape the sides. That way they're good and closed. I will measure this time for that one. And I got a little extra. If you get a little extra, you can cut it off with the scissors. So now we have, and it's closed, our little um, envelope I made out of a catalog page. Um, I know I saw that one other girl put labels on hers, like on the front, and then wrote people's addresses and do that. I think you can do that. I generally don't. I'll put this in another envelope or I'll put it in with their order. And I also have made up, and I'll post these later, because um, I gotta go to work as soon as I get done this video. Darn JLB right now, but you know, my son's going to college, so I gotta pay for those expensive books that are $2,000 a, a semester, and tuition, which is really expensive. I have these cute little labels. I don't know if you can see this, it's probably backwards. It says, you got sprinkled today. I know there's another one out there that says, I got sprinkled today. I actually changed this, because that way when somebody opens this up, um, it's it's speaking right to them, and I usually use it to seal up the envelope. So it says, you got sprinkled today. That way you're talking to the customer. And then what I do is I take the shop host join brochures, the purse brochures that are in your back office. These are handy dandy. I have them available all the time. So make sure you order some if you don't have them. And then um, a sample. Um, I sometimes I'll put three samples inside here um, But today for this it's just easy enough you fold the fold the uh, brochure in half because it, it's a little bit too long for the envelope well, Maybe not Yeah, it's a little oh, yeah, it'll fit in there So if you want you could put three samples in there, but today I have a sample Stapled to my business card and I print out these labels that have the scent and then I write it and then it says heat don't eat and then it's, it's stapled to my business card. And then I just fold this up and stick it right in there. That way they've got all the shop host join information. And of course my label's on the back too. And then you just put it in the envelope. And put the little, little seal on it. Just like so. And it's all sealed up and ready to go. And you can drop it. You can give these to people, you can drop it in. If you're shipping something, it's easy peasy to put it in their box. You know, if, you've, if you're if you in the Club Pink, which y'all should be, um, 
put a sample of your next club pink in there um, and send it to them you can also mail these um, and it fits in a regular size envelope so um, yeah so it's easy peasy and it's a really good way to use up your catalogs plus you know it's got all these pictures on here so they're you know they can kind of see that too so easy peasy envelopes made out of catalog pages yay hi Akira this is your tutorial hope you love it so all right well I have to go now unfortunately to the J-O-B but I hope you enjoyed this and maybe I'll do more soon so thanks have a great day and hey oh a little reminder um uh booking blitz today so everybody blitz yay book lots of parties so we can all make lots of money sell a pc yay all right have a great day bye